When I was a little boy, I, I used to like play army. And I remember one time I'd asked my dad, uh, we went to like an air show where they have all the airplanes and everything. There's an army table. And I remember asking him, I was like, can I sign up for the army? And I remember he told me, next year, next year. So I guess maybe since being a little kid. My name is Stephen London. I'm 29 years old. I served in the Army before attending AUBG, and this is part of my story. I ended up signing up or enlisting in the Army uh, after I had uh, finished a year of college and took some time off. And I was 19, uh, so it was definitely a brand new experience for me. I didn't know what I was exactly getting into in the middle of a a war that was going on, but um, yeah, as far as the military, it started out as a uh, big unknown adventure. So here I am on my first deployment. I'm in one of the guard towers before the selfie was invented. My first thought was that I'd be going to Afghanistan with all my brand new gear that looked a lot nicer, so I was more worried about how I looked, <laughs> actually because I knew that everybody's gear was going to be dirty and, and used and everything. But uh, outside of that, uh, the best way I can kind of compare it is, like if you think of a sports team or something, or you think of somebody that does all the practices and everything, and they never play the game, and then one day the coach is like, all right, time to go. I'm going to put you in. So you're like, hey, well, what do I do? It's the first time. So yeah, maybe a little bit of nervousness. Oh, he can catch. Uh, this is myself and one of our interpreters uh, who would do all the translating between us and the uh, Afghan people. He was a pretty good interpreter. Pretty much uh, all of my deployments except one uh, lost soldiers. Uh, third deployment, my group was supposed to go out and pick up mail that day and uh, just before uh, we got called out to do that, we got called out to do another mission. So we went that way and so another Another one of the groups went out. It was totally safe for them. They went out, they crossed over a bridge, they got the mail, and then as they were on their way back, uh, the bridge that they were driving over before, uh, the Taliban, had, they put uh, explosives in the bridge, and so it blew up the whole bridge and all the vehicles, so we lost, uh, we lost a few soldiers that day. Literally, it probably very much could have been me. It wasn't until like the last second that uh, our mission changed. So maybe, maybe somebody up above was looking out for me. I, I guess I would just say I was, I was grateful in a, in a weird sense of the word. Let's see. Oh, that was a cold day uh, on this day. We were up on a mountaintop and it was so cold and the weather changed on us. Anything that could have gone wrong that day pretty much did. Like woke up for the mission that day and I had like a little good luck charm that a friend of mine had given me and that was gone, and then uh, I didn't feel very well and <laughs> had a bad feeling about it. And um, oh, we climbed the wrong mountain. <laughs> so someone's like, well, I'll tell you the good news or the bad news. Good news is good job on climbing the mountain. The bad news is the mountain we need to be is over there. So we get over there and exhausted and tired. And, and so it was finally my time to like rest a little bit, and I had a feeling that I wasn't going to get to rest too much. And so uh, we started getting shot at from maybe about, maybe about 300 meters away. And so we fired back at them with our weapons and we told everybody where they were. The bullets crack a little bit over us. And then there was, while we were shooting and everything, we see something that right between us uh, went like this. So we looked and we're like, wow, that was really close. And then we went back and you know, finished out the mission. Um, so I'd say that would be maybe the closest I ever was to being shot. I don't regret it. There was, uh, there was a lot of good times. There was a few bad times and everything, but definitely helped me uh, develop as a person. 